damn it! It's decided. You better come to the beach with me later. Huh? For God of damn it! I saw some big ones that fell onto the shore. No, I think pink just means that they're, uh, yeah, that you can just interact with them. Eager. First, I have a question for you all. That Monokuma thing ordered us to kill each other. So under these strange circumstances, what do you think we need right now? I love how everyone is like, that Monokuma thing. <laughs> 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 Who the fuck knows? Get to the point already. If you want me to get to the point, you better hurry up and answer my question. Huh? What do we need? We need food and sleep, obviously, right? <laughs> no, you've forgotten about shitting. <laughs> Which means the answers are a good appetite, a good night's sleep, and a good shit. We <laughs> <laughs> die is so good. I hate it. Does anyone have a real answer? Could it be a bond? Bond? This is what I believe. As long as the ultimates work together, there is nothing we can't accomplish. <laughs> You'll all be create a hope that can overcome any despair. That's why, if we want to escape this island, we need to promise each other that we'll work together. Himo. Wow, he said that with a straight face. How is he not embarrassed? Ah, <laughs> uh, just as I figured, that was kind of lame, huh? Shikashi. However, he does have a point. That must be why Monokuma is enforcing a rule that will cause us to be suspicious of each other. I see. That was a pretty good answer. But you're not getting a stone. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Since it's impossible to face our enemy as individuals under these circumstances, we must fight as a group. Hmm. However, what we need to achieve... <coughs> Are you okay? Do you need to go to Nurse's office? Yeah, yes, I do. <laughs> However, what we need to achieve that solidarity is not something as easy going and optimistic as the board. <laughs> <laughs> I could hear you. Like, you could hear it slowly starting to fall apart. <laughs> I can't believe Coco just fucking died. <laughs> it's okay, just, just just talk like me that, if that helps. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Then you what? We'll be back to your usual Biakuya voice at a later date. <laughs> oh god, what happened to your voice? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you feel right. I see. And sports teams need captains after all. Rejoice, I shall accept the position. Uh, uh? Now then, I'll wrap up this introduction. Let's move on to the main question. Hey, Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> Wait just a second. Nanda. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> what did you just say? I don't care how you excuse it. You're being too forceful. 
Deciding to be the leader all on your own. And why does it have to be you anyway? <laughs> because you got the prettiest one. of yours is too forceful! Mahir, <laughs> please wait. I wanna hear him do a good <laughs> It's true that Byakuya may be a little forceful, but given our current situation... I believe it's a leader's duty, under circumstances like this, to be forceful to a certain degree. That may be true, but... If we just need someone who can lead people, then even Sonia can. I just want a girl in charge, okay, to step on me, okay? I was gonna say, gosh, gosh, with the way you're talking. <laughs> no, perish the thought, I am merely a figurehead. Well, he must have the qualities of a leader if he can accept the role under these circumstances, and he can also step on you. <laughs> If everyone's okay with it, I'm okay with it too. Not the stepping on <laughs> <laughs> Then, I guess we've made our decision. Don't worry, as long as I'm the leader, I won't let anyone become a victim. I will guide you all, that's what I promise! Thanks, Mickey. Yeah, so reliable! It's true he's reliable, but... I'm a little surprised. I don't think he was the type of guy who says something like that. I expected the ultimate affluent progeny to look down on us like we're bugs or something. He does, but we're his bugs. <laughs> <laughs> now then, let's move on to the topic at hand. For real this time, I have something to show you all. Is it Disneyland? Yes. <laughs> Something to show us? It's at Jabberwock Park at the cin- Jesus Christ. <laughs> he just made like a re really loud pounding noise <laughs> as he walked away. <laughs> He's a big boy. It's at Jabberwock <laughs> Park at the Central Island. Come, follow me. After saying it so bluntly, Biakia turned and left the restaurant, stomping his feet along the way. Just as I thought, he sure is forceful. Aww. Jeez, we may have made a mistake in choosing him as the leader. Though everyone made similar complaints, they all followed Byakuya out of the restaurant. Except me. And Gundam. And Akane. <laughs> and the food. <laughs> and the food. You don't have to pay attention to me, just go. I'll catch up with the food. You don't seem so persuasive when you have that look on your face. I can't help it. Why they're hungry? I lose most of my energy. So. After she said that, I kind of ate the entire pile of food on her plate in one gulp. Ate so fast, I thought you even tasted it. Oh. What happened? <laughs> Are you choking? I guess I should go for now. My four dark devils of destruction, let us venture to the end of the earth. 
Chapperwa Park. There's no need to shout. Just hurry up and go already. Tamaka Gundam! <laughs> Every time he says Deva, I think he's saying Diva. <laughs> That's what I thought at first, too. <laughs> I better hurry and follow after Byakuya. He's at Yarrow World Park, I believe. I like I love I like how you got out out of, through the window. <laughs> Just <laughs> jump. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? You should hurry over to the park. Yeah! yeah! Ah! Didn't the same thing <laughs> happen last time too? Hajime, how many times are you gonna surprise me? I just spoke to you normally. Anyway, you should hurry over to the park. <laughs> Shut up! I'm going back to my room. Seriously, this is all just one big hassle. Ah, damn it! Seriously, if we're a tropical paradise, then why are we in this situation in the first place? Isn't that right? Isn't a vacation supposed to be nothing but lounging around and sipping coconut juice? Uh, sure, but not the coconut juice part. <laughs> Re relax. Snapping and they won't change a thing, okay? Oh no, Kokodai. No! She's becoming coconut juice. <laughs> 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 Come over there. <laughs> you can't, cause you're sick. Bam. August tenth. Just count down the days. You're getting a punch too. <laughs> <laughs> You'll forget. Coco will count like every punch, just from now until next August. <laughs> Jimmy, it's decided. You better come to the beach with me later. Huh? For coconuts, damn it! I saw some big ones that fell onto the shore. Don't talk about my nuts that way. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't figured how to split them up, and but once I do, we're gonna have ourselves some coconut juice. You can't just swill a coconut open. Just give up and get some coconut juice from the supermarket. How would you get natural coconut juice? <laughs> ah, you just don't understand! Fine, be that way! I'm never gonna ask for your help again. He left. I hope he goes straight to the park. Now then, I should hurry too. I was wondering if you if you remember. <laughs> run, Hinata, run! <laughs> I thought that said one punch market. <laughs> one punch! I would have died at the supermarket. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Konetsu will just have gone into the supermarket and add both <laughs> Uh, Through the bridge, I think? Are those arrows that you clickable so you can just like go super fast? Uh, I don't think so. Or do they just indicate that you can go that way? I think they just yeah, because I don't like I don't have access to the uh, rectic 
Wasn't there a way to go like super fast? Yeah, I know on the yeah, video you could. The maps, I think you can like instantly. No, but I remember there was a way in the beta, uh, like you did something and and Hinata just ran away like and... Sonic. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> You are just too fast for us. Uh. This! I never expected a fat so like him to move so fast. So, what's supposed to be here? Nothing. Here? Really? I mean, meh. If you haven't noticed it yet, then I was right to dismiss, dismiss you all as idiots. Yeah, um... That doesn't seem ominous at all. Not at all. <laughs> How fat so they can move fast? Is he talking about pigs and cows? It is like a game of a spot the difference. I am actually quite good at that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nakia probably wants us to see that thing right in front of us. What thing? What are you talking about? I see what appears as I this man, this teeming with evil energy. Such a comforting feeling. It's actually quite nice. Oh yeah, oh yeah? Wow, sirs! Well, what is that? It's all like dun dun dun. <laughs> hmm. I see. He wanted to show us that. <gasps> that? You mean that? That? Yeah. <laughs> no, Warnings at this park aren't so bad. Well, even so. I still prefer the quiet mornings of my big city hometown. Eh? Uh, huh? What is that? Was that thing there when we came here last time? Oy, oy. That thing looks pretty big. I'm probably just thinking too much, right? <laughs> no! <laughs> what is that? I swear that wasn't there yesterday! Oh no, not that thing. And that was like, what? What thing? Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Well, what is that? An obviously out of place object placed in the center of a peaceful park that Coco took like 10 minutes to look at. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a clock, but something seems off. It's counting down! It's actually counting up and down. <laughs> God damn. Was this here when we came last time? Yeah. No, I'm pretty sure it wasn't. <laughs> I found 
found it this morning when I was exploring the island one more time. It's unknown when it was actually placed here. Do we know? Monaco must have placed this object. What does this countdown even mean? I have no clue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Once again, something has appeared that I don't understand. But it's got nothing to do with me, because I refuse to believe this is happening. <laughs> it's complete denial. Could it be? It better not be a bomb. Someone said it off so we can go home. A bomb! If they wanted to blow up the island. They would have done so by now. There's no need for a countdown. Uh, then... What are they counting down? Mm. It's a mystery. A mysterious mystery, isn't it? Monomi? Huh? Wh why are you here? I heard everyone talking while I was patrolling, so I came over. No, not that. Didn't Monokuma kill you? Ah, so that's why you were surprised? <laughs> you don't have to worry about that. After all, I can never die. <laughs> now that you mention it, she doesn't need, like, a spare or something. A spare? What a mean thing to say! <laughs> However, you have arrived at the perfect time. There's something I wanted to ask you. Oi. What is the meaning behind this timer and this countdown? Answer me! I love it. Huh? <laughs> Countdown? <laughs> huh? What? What? What is this? Uh, um, I'm sorry. I don't know what this is. You really don't know. I I'm sorry. I don't really have a grasp of what Monokuma is up to. You don't know even though you're Monokuma's little sister. I'm <laughs> not my brother's little sister. Hmm. <laughs> Did you accept the role or not? Which one is it? A anyway, let's all do our best. Let's kick the evil Monokuma off this island. Huh. If you don't know what the countdown is for, your useless trust gets lost. <laughs> um, let's take the I said get lost! Yeah. I I'm sorry! Whoa. <laughs> Rip Ryan. It's bully Ryan Knight. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps you are being a little too harsh? I'm starting to feel sorry for it. 
It. That's what I was gonna say. It. It. <laughs> Miss Sonia, may I call you Miss Sonia? Now I insist on calling you that. There's no need to feel sorry for that thing. She's obviously working with Monokuma. Oi, Kura. Who the fuck cares about that stuffed animal? More importantly, what the hell is that? Hmm. Looks ominous, doesn't it? Who put that object here and how they did it in just one night? Mm, I can't imagine. Which means it doesn't make any sense! Also, it's deadly! <laughs> However, that's not all that's unimaginable. This island is full of mysteries that we can't begin to imagine. For example, how were the 16 of us brought to this island? Oh. I wasn't trying to think about that since it's been bugging me too, but he's right. That is a mystery. There's more. Why is Jabberwock Island, which was known for being a popular resort destination, now an uninhabited island? There's no sign of tourists or even citizens on this island. Is something like that even possible? So it collapsed. Society is much like fruit. As it matures, it is inevitable that it will eventually rot. As the economy grows, the private sector stagnates as elders and bureaucrats become more and more powerful. As time passes, this power becomes the status quo and crushes the seeds of any possible reformation. Such a sad trend. Mm, I don't really understand all that, but I feel like the situation here is somewhat different. Maybe the monobies killed everyone on this island. That's how it became uninhabited! That's a possibility, but we don't know that for sure. <laughs> this mystery remains a mystery, it seems. Grrr! It's like everything here is just full of mystery! <laughs> You're right. It's mysteries on top of mysteries. However, since these mysteries are overlapping with one another, I doubt some no-name group is behind this. Well, what are you trying to say? I mean, the situation we're in is undeniably the work of some enormous organization. <gasps> enormous organization? Konomi. <laughs> Monokuma, the Mono Beasts, they're all machines that require major technical skill to operate. Yabakune? Plus, they need a ton of funding, and there's no way those things were made just for the hell of it. That organization might be controlling these machines and monitoring the islands with those cameras. <laughs> Could those fiends be hiding on this island? Arya. Likely, they're probably running this from somewhere else. Somewhere safe. Where would that be? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, there's no mistake that an enormous organization is behind all this. That, that, so many organizations say it with that Mickey Mouse voice, it's making me think of Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> <laughs> Big organization, huh? I can't imagine what kind of people they could be. Tsumarida. Well, let's see. Someone led by Amazon, perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> There's my Togami Corporation, Sonya's Novo Selic Kingdom, and the Kozuruyu clan. 
It would definitely have to be an organization as powerful as one of those groups, if not more so. Huh? <laughs> I'm used to being mistrusted. Do what you will. Hold up! I don't care about your Tikusuri plan, but I won't allow you to doubt Miss Sonia. Miss Sonia is a hot blood princess. There's a sharp distinction between her and you, Pax. Now she was a hot, dark haired princess. Screw her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, just shut up already, loser. L loser? Are you talking about me? It's obvious from your flashy clothes that you just want to stand out because you're actually a loser. <laughs> it must be hard to make your living in the lame-ass loser industry. Too far, dude. That's going way too far. Bully Kazui today. <laughs> hey, Piaguya. <laughs> Were you serious just now? About this being related to your family and Sonya's and such? Saying they have anything to do with this. But you're certain that we're up against a huge organization, right? Shikashi. Even if such an organization exists, why would they make us go through something like this? Whatever. As long as we keep her hand has <laughs> <laughs> How long are we gonna keep talking about this? Why don't we talk about something more realistic? Hmm. Our enemy's purpose is still unknown. As long as we find out who's behind this, we'll learn their purpose. Tsunami. So what we must do now is find out who our enemy is. If we do that, we'll be that much closer to a breakthrough. I really feel like I'm playing Kingdom Hearts right now. <laughs> <laughs> Just... Luckily, according to the e-handbook, we are free to explore this island. Eka. There will definitely be a clue about the enemy on this island somewhere. Let's start looking, and whatever you do, do not let the darkness take your heart. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's get this crap done. Uh, what are we looking for? Akane, were you even listening? We need to find clues that will tell us who our enemy is. Your Yokaro. No problem. No matter how large this organization may be, they will not be able to stand against us. Yuki. They are destined to fall and turn to ash at the might of my four dark devils of destruction. <laughs> Just look at them, they are so powerful. <laughs> wow! Hamsters came out of your scarf! <laughs> they are so adorable. Huh, adorable, you say? Oh. Aww. <laughs> ah, and thus was born my OTP. <laughs> oh yeah. Thank you. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You're pretty happy about that, huh? Huh? Look at that guy talking to me, Sonia, all casually. Casually. I'm definitely gonna beat the crap out of him later. I bet one of his hamsters could beat the crap out of you. <laughs> <laughs> Just one of them. Just one, a singular hamster. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I, I don't... Oh, what? Um, I actually <laughs> didn't start keeping track of the time, so I don't know if it's time yet. But, uh, we'll call it there for now for this episode. Thank you guys for joining us, and see you next time. Bye bye. bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Boy. Water level. Eat. You have not been to this region of the downside. Before she left, Big Virtue shared knowledge of a current that she draw you out to see. Let's go. Let's hope we don't get swept away and go somewhere else. Is it gonna transform like midway? I want to see it. Yes! Oh! Amazing! <laughs> I love it.
<laughs> I don't know. So it's... Oh my god, it's so cute. <laughs> uh, I love this game. <laughs> <laughs> you and your companions watch the sea as your wagon rolls over the gentle waves. Uh, I can't blame Jadario if it's if it's like, yeah, it's like bobbing that much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's nothing. <laughs> <laughs>